Hi, I'm John with Traditions Performance Firearms, and today we're going to show you how to load and shoot your bolt action muzzle loader. Before loading and shooting any muzzle loader, always check to make sure that your muzzle loader is both deprimed and there's not a charge already in the barrel. To check and make sure your muzzle loader is deprimed on a bolt action, simply open your bolt, and inside the ejection port here, you can visually inspect and check with your finger to make sure that there's not a primer in here. With these bolt actions, you have varying nipples between number 11 musket cap and 209 primers, 209 shotgun primers. For all three of these, you should be able to get in and deprime your gun from this point. To check and make sure there's not a charge in the barrel, simply leave your bolt open with the safety on. Take your range rod and check the bore. If the hash mark that we've marked here for an unloaded barrel mates up to the muzzle, we know we don't have a charge in that gun. With your field rod, simply run that down the bore, and if it becomes flush with the muzzle, you know you don't have a charge in that rifle. We're going to hang on to this because we're going to use it again later. To clear out any debris or anything that might be in your communication hole area in your bolt action muzzle loader, one easy way to do that is to simply take a primer and fire it through the communication hole and knock out any debris or oil that's in there. For this one we have a 209 nipple in the breech plug. We're just going to take a 209 primer and seat it in the primer pocket. And from here, simply close your bolt, move the safety to the fire position, and fire the rifle. From there, open your bolt, and with your depriming tool provided with the gun, remove the primer from the nipple. Once all that debris is clear from your breech plug area, you're ready to load and fire your gun. To load and fire your bolt action muzzle loader, today we're going to be using 90 grains of loose 209 blackhorn powder, a 250 grain Smackdown Sabot, and Federal 209 shotgun primers. You can also bring your speed loader to the range and use this for follow-up shots. To load this gun, all I'm simply going to do is bring the rifle back, take the cap off of my pre-measured powder charge, pour it down the muzzle. Make sure you pour that in there completely to get your full charge in the muzzle. Next, take your 250 grain Smackdown Sabot and just center this with your fingers. Get it started part of the way down the bore and switch to your ball starter and push this down until the shoulder meets the muzzle of your barrel. Once you have your ball started down the barrel, you can switch over to your ramrod or your range rod and seat your bullet firmly against the powder charge. If you're using your range rod and it's the first time shooting your rifle, one thing you can do is take your field rod and go ahead and run that down the barrel against your charge. And we either with a pocket knife to scribe a line or using a sharpie, just mark on your ramrod where that load stops against this field rod. This will help you with follow-up shots and loading and shooting in the field. From here, remount your rifle into the vise. And at this point, you have a full load in your rifle, you're ready to prime and fire. To prime and fire your rifle, simply take your 209 shotgun primer and seat it into the nipple on your breech plug. Close your bolt. Shoulder your rifle. Move your safety from the safe to the fire position and you're ready to fire your gun. 